Is it a bird? Is it a plane? Nope, it's Easter Seal's annual Drop Zone charity event with participants rappelling down a 20-story building who have raised money for BC children with disabilities. But before they take the plunge, some training is required. So they participate in one training session at, uh, at Cliffhanger. Um, they spend about two hours learning about the equipment, getting a, a practice time going down the wall. Uh, and then when they get here, uh, usually a week or two later, uh, they'll go through the same thing again. We'll get them harnessed up. And then uh, after that, they get to try it on this uh, smaller wall here. It just as one last refresher before they go up. And then that's it. They go up to the top and then they wrap down. Participants have 20 floors to give them time to reflect on what will happen once they reach the top. For a challenge that started in the lunchroom between Debbie Morrow and Sherry Gersney, they ended up taking this one to the top and right back down again. I don't think I had anything in my head. <laughs> I, I just, and I couldn't look anywhere. I just had to look at this rope all the way down. I was just I kept scary. having to remember every so often to stop looking at the rope and pay attention to the reflection in the mirror with the mountains and the water behind. Over the past five years, Easter Seals Drop Zone has raised an impressive $974,000 for BC children with disabilities. So whether you're a cowardly lion or a, su a Nintendo superhero, everyone can take the plunge and it's for a good cause. Casey Snow in Vancouver for BCIT Magazine. Ah. <laughs>